He was born in Mexico, educated in Paris, and worked in New York City. Now Julian Zagaza Gordier, the new director and CEO of the Nelson Atkins Museum of Art, is in Kansas City. Tonight's community profile, he shares his vision for the arts in our community. One of the newest acquisitions of the Nelson Atkins Museum of Art is not what you call a masterpiece, but a golf cart to drive visitors around. This is the maiden voyage indeed. Julian Zagaza Gordier, the museum's newly acquired CEO, playfully named it the shuttle cart to match the famous shuttlecock sitting on the museum lawn. From the ancient Chinese temple exhibit to modern photography, Mr. Z, as he is called, says the Nelson speaks to everyone, and he's inviting the whole community to hear it. When you have a resource like this one that I tell you so many people would roll over to have in their city, um, and that us Kansas Cityans are not taking full advantage of it, it, it just... It just tells us that we should be doing something to bring them and to nurture that relationship. The birth certificate of this game here. To nurture a relationship with sports fans, he brought in Nate Smith's original rules of basketball, hoping to draw on March Madness. Mr. Z is also embracing more partnerships with schools, lectures, and special events, including a Monet exhibit with something special on Mother's Day. It doesn't matter to him how you see art, just see it. Of course you can come and try to set a record. How quickly can I run through all the exhibits at the Nelson? And that's a way to see it. And I've done it. I've tried to time myself, and I think it's still a better record to do. But you can also spend one day only seeing one piece of art. And those two experiences will speak differently, you know? And since art is in the eye of the beholder, it's okay with him if you don't like something, even if it's a multi-million dollar masterpiece. But there's some that you like more than others that you really don't care for and some that you will definitely ask why are they here I don't like them and you're gonna be passionate what I love is when art puts you in that mood whether you love it hate it the worst is art that leaves you indifferent that is Mr. Z, and I, I really love his name, but I have such a hard time <laughs> pronouncing hard it. Name. He is absolutely delightful. He would like for more people in Kansas City to do more collecting. Doesn't have to be expensive, but he had a lot to say. I had to chop my story way down because they said I had to give him some time for weather. But you can watch the whole interview by going to our website, NBCActionNews.com. Look under Lifestyle. Uh, he's definitely plugged into Kansas City. I see him at many events, and he's really seemed to be a neat guy. Yeah. And he's he is. doing a good job. The museum is great. And it's free. It's donation only, which yeah. is always a plus.